Hey everybody, it's me, Jimmy Butler. The next game, I'm either going to be proving to everyone that I am MJ's biological son or getting clowned for the rest of my NBA career. Bro, bro, how could they let the Celtics make a 3 0 comeback on them like. <laughs> What did you say, nigga? Like, Jason Tatum gotta be hit because how are they allowing the Celtics to make a comeback? That was up 3 0. Like, if the Celtics win the next game, they really want to make history. Only the Avatar, master of all four elements, could stop them. But when the world needed him most, he vanished. And Jason Tatum is already a stamping like finals MVP at that point. Yeah, he's gonna be a Hall of Famer at that point. But like, bro, Jimmy, you are MJ, son. You gotta get it together, my boy. I know that boy Jimmy sweaty breaks because the Celtics gotta be his kryptonite or something. Like he be playing like prime MJ when the playoff time comes. But when he plays against the Celtics, he turns to Superman when he get hit with kryptonite. There's no other explanation as to why he always sells against the Celtics. Like he's really MJ's son. You feel me? Because you know, you know how MJ his kryptonite was the Detroit Pistons. Yeah, Jimmy Butler's kryptonite is the Celtics, Bruh. and that's very understandable. You feel me? Because you know, Celtics are a good. Team, but like I didn't expect them to win the first three games in a row. I really thought it was gonna be like hitting five. Realistically, we all thought it was gonna be hitting five. You feel me? We all saw how Jimmy did the Bucks, and we all thought he was gonna do the same thing to the Celtics, but not the same thing. I realistically, we all thought it was heat in six, not five. Bruh. Eight. Nonetheless, bro, nobody was expecting the Celtics to make a 3-0 comeback. Like Derek White is really him, and Jason Tatum, that boy be hooping for real. He, hey, he might be, he might be Kobe reincarnated. He be talking about he, how he tried to be like Kobe for real. I don't know why he be waiting till the backed up against the wall in the series to like you know start locking in. You feel me? Because he did the same thing against the 76ers. He, be, he really be waiting like he'd be selling the first half of the series and then when everything was online he want to turn into prom kobe like that's that's really that, that mama, mama mentality, mentality right there. i'm telling y'all bro it ain't devin booker it's really jason tatum he got that mama mentality he don't want to take the easy way out bro he wants to suffer you feel me instead of you know winning a series you know by playing good the first couple times he, he wants to play like trash and then actually you know win the series but all of to kobe though he really my one of my favorite players so i'm even gonna say he in this you feel me Jimmy Butler done pulled up to hoops, you feel me? We're gonna see if I can win like three games in a row, then you know it's heat in seven, bro. If I, if I'm three games in a row this video, then it's really heat in seven. I'm gonna hold you. I'm gonna lie, bro. I just woke up, it's like 8 a.m. right now. So my voice like it's kinda raspy. I'm gonna hold you, but let's see what we got going on this day. Let's spin it. Do 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 bro, so we get shield. Okay, they, they give us money, yo. Give us money. They give us money, bro. I don't know I'm supposed to do that. I'm already rich as hell. I'm an NBA player, bro. I'm Jimmy Buckets, bro. You feel me? I'm just biological son. My, my father is a billionaire, billionaire. bro. Like y'all think I need a thousand dollars from who's like Get out of here, bro. I'm gonna hold you. Hey, let's hop into a game real quick. So we for the do. Embarrassed by the Celtics next game. Hey, he got a good defense. I'm gonna hold you. He played the best defense I've ever seen from someone that is still riding a bicycle hoops. Who's the, who is still riding a bicycle hoops, bro? I'm gonna hold you. It's 2023 and you're still riding a bicycle, bro. This might be Jason Tatum playing on hoops right now. I'm gonna lie. Look at the way he locking me up, bro. But yeah, Jason Tatum. I mean, Jimmy Butler, you no, know, he really is MJ's son because MJ always choked against, you know, the Pistons. So that means that, like, you feel me? The Celtics might be his kryptonite the same way that the Detroit Pistons was MJ's kryptonite. The Celtics might be Jimmy Butler's kryptonite. Because if they lose Game 7 after being up 3-0... For one, the Celtics going definitely. Actually, no, I don't think the Celtics going to win the finals because the Denver Nuggets, like, they really swept the Lakers. They got hella rest time. Look at how both these teams are struggling against each other. Imagine the Celtics with Nikola Jokic and Jamal Hemi. The, his bubble one was not a fluke, bro. The way he played in the bubble, it wasn't a fluke. Everybody saying it was a fluke, but it wasn't a fluke because look at how Jamal Murray played right now, bro. I ain't gonna lie, he's really cut like that. The Celtics make a comeback right here. For one, they're gonna make history because no other NBA team has done that before. And then Jimmy Butler will get clowned. Everybody, everybody gonna still call him playoff Jimmy and Hemi buckets, but. He gonna get clowned for the rest of his NBA career, which is gonna be a very long career. God, hey. Hopefully, but I ain't gonna lie, I still like Jimmy though. Me personally, I got Jimmy over Tatum. I got Jimmy as a better player than Jason Tatum, but Jason's really got that Mamba mentality because he be trying to make himself suffer for no reason. Because why does he wait till the end of a series when he's about to get, you know, knocked out the playoffs to start locking in and playing like prom Kobe? It's crazy. 55 points to put away the 76ers is insane, bro. Come on, if y'all can hop on, bro. I'm gonna lie, why is it just noobs hopping on right now, bro? I need calm, bro. I'm recording. Good for you. Hey, hey, you see, you smart, bro. Hey, shout out to my boy, Fran Fish, for, you know, hopping on. You know, he's pretty smart, you feel me? I'm about to get some free cloud. I ain't gonna hold you. Yo, the earrings is tough. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all really not seen them for real. They cut, they, they four millimeter. I'm like, they did this one three times, bro. That's a punk, that's a puncture three times, you feel me? For them to, you know, get it in. Because the first time, they put the wrong color. Then the second time, it broke. Bruh. And then the third time, they finally got it right. So it still stains, but I did it like a week ago. So I should, I should be straight now. I did it like a week from this time that I'm doing this video. It's like a week from the time that this video drops. This is gonna be when, you feel me? I don't, I don't even know what I'm talking about, but I might just be chatting. But hey, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? I thought I was about to say, I missed that right there. I'm, I'm literally Jimmy Butler reincarnated right now, bro.
I'm MJ reincarnated, bro. Y'all can't tell me that that's not my father, bro, because I don't know who my father is either, so. Y'all know, know how MJ was, but he was really wilding for real, so, you know. I can't really say who my father was, but yo, let me get this dunk real quick. I need to change my dunk animations. Oh my god. Alright, let me get another dunk real quick. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna ignore what just happened right there. Where are you going, bro? I'm right here. Oh my god. I wanna get a good dunk though, I'm gonna lie. I'm not liking those dunks I'm getting. Let me get a good one real quick. Alright, that's better. Hit me buckets, you feel me? Put in the buckets. On these non hoopers, these casuals, you feel me? Alright, let me do them dirty right here, I ain't gonna load you. Where is he going? Try, bro. Why, why did why did it break his ankles? He literally jumped, bro. What a walk out of bounds, just to say. Why is he not jumping, bro? That's so weird. You should, bro, he should be jumping more, bro. You literally about to lose the game. Yeah, bro. Ain't nobody beating Jimmy Buckets today. I just need to win one more game and it's heating seven, y'all. One more game and it's heating seven. Game in the season seven, you feel me? Celtics not making a comeback against Hemi Buckets. Like, get out of here! Don't play with me. Hemi Buckets, bro. MJ's biological son. I ain't gonna lie, I'm just realizing this is about to be the first video I've ever made that I post on the same day. Like, by the time I finish making this video and I edit and I do all that stuff, I'm gonna post the video. You feel me? This is about to be the first video that I made that I post on the same day. It's crazy. That is insane, bro. Like, I'm really thinking about it. Like, I, I don't be posting videos the same day I make them. Like, I really wear, like, a week or two before I post the video. But I realized that, you know, Jimmy Butler, I don't know, he not, he not playing, like, MJ right now, you feel me? So I was like, bro, let me just make a video about Jimmy Butler, you feel me? So hopefully the Heat can win, because I want the Heat to win, bro. I, I, need the, I need that Heat versus Nuggets final, you feel me? Not the Heat versus Celtics. Because we all know the Celtics probably going to get their cheeks clapped. Y'all saw the way that the Nuggets did, you know, the Lakers, so... But if it's the Heat, then it might be more interesting because the Heat go use the power of friendship against the, you know, Nuggets. Like, you know, Tom Foolery versus efficient basketball, you feel me? Jason Tatum one does Tom Foolery the function, he goes crazy, I ain't gonna hold you. But I really wanna see like what, you know, Jamal Murray gonna do against, you know, Jimmy Butler and what Jimmy Butler gonna do against Jamal Murray. I wanna see, I wanna see how they fare against each other, you feel me? I wanna see how they play against each other. But if I get this 21-0 right here, the Heat is definitely gonna win the seven, so I gotta lock in right here. Get this 21 over real quick. And that's Heat in 7, baby. I seen in 7. You heard it right here, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it right here. Heat in 7. Heat in 7. Oh, I got to play another game. That's Heat in 7, ladies and gentlemen. Y'all heard it right here. I'm about to win this extra game real quick for no reason, but that's really Heat in 7. Whatever happens in the game, I already played three games here. You feel me? To symbolize the Heat being up 3-0. So maybe if I win this game 4-0, it'll 100% be Heat in 7. So let me try to lock in right here. Even though it's already going to be Heat in 7, you feel me? So like... The Celtics not taking it this year, bro. I promise you. They're not making the finals this year. They tried though. You feel me? A double record. Appreciate you. W Street, bro. W Streak. You feel me? Okay, good steal. Look at the defense from Jimmy Butler. He's playing that MJ kind of defense. That's really how you know he's MJ's son, bro. That's also how you know he's MJ's son, because he just missed a three-pointer. But, you know, look at that defense right there. That, that's his father's defense. That's the defense his man was. That's the defense his father was playing in the playoffs, you feel me? That's, that's the reason his father's a defensive player of the year. I ain't gonna hold you. Jimmy Butler got them defensive genes too, you feel me? And that scoring ability is insane. Oh, I gotta take him to the paint, hit him with a fadeaway. Bro, Anthony Edwards is also, you know, Michael Jordan's son too. Like, Anthony Edwards looks more like MJ than Jimmy Butler does. And they both play like the same kind of. I to take him to the paint. Give me that. Mm, look at that fake way, bro. I'm really Michael Jordan's son. Y'all can't tell me nothing else, but that's my father, bro. I'm gonna hit him with the paternity. I'm gonna hit him with the paternity test in a couple years. 
with that DNA test. I'm gonna pull it to his crib, hit him with that DNA test. We all know where MJ lives. He probably lives somewhere in California or something. I don't know, bro. In some billion dollar mansion. So I'm gonna pull it to his crib, hit him with a DNA test. If you're like, you're really my father, bro. Don't play with me. I'm gonna go into his bathroom and then get some of his DNA. We don't know what type of DNA is gonna be, but I'm gonna get his DNA regardless. You feel me? Pull it to the doctors, yo. You know the vibes. He said, I wet. Yo! Yo! I wet. Yo! Why would you say? Yo! Yo, why would you say that, bro? He said, I wet. Yeah, why are you wet? Bro, I know you. That's mad. That's mad pause, bro. Why, is, why would you say that? He said, never mind. Yeah, never mind, bro. AK a, a word. AK word. AK word. What is he talking about? Y'all just, just be talking to talk on this game, bro. You're not, you're, not, you're not speaking sense, bro. You're not making any coherent sentences. Your sentences are not coherent, my brother. You're talking, but you're not talking at the same time. No, I'm, I'm kind of congested right now, so that's really just making me sound difficult to talk. Oh my god, that's GG's. That's GG's. Hit me, Butler. Him, James. Jimmy Buck is like, play off Jimmy. I'm really Michael Jordan's son. Y'all can't tell me nothing else, bro. I'm going with you. Yo, appreciate you. Hey, hey, Heat and Seven. You heard it here first. Heat and seven, bro. You heard it here first. You feel me? I just leaked the NBA script, y'all. You feel me? So that's really heat and seven. Y'all heard it here first. Heat and seven. Hope y'all enjoyed today's nicely. You feel me? Whose video? Hopefully it's gonna be heat and seven. But you know, here we go.